All right, so Easter dinner. I decided to come out of retirement because I realized can't nobody pull the way he's pulled. I mean, on some real shit. I've had people fry this, fry that, and shit's great. Shout out to Nettie because her shit's the only kind that I would eat that be like banging, like banging, seriously banging. People be having platters and shit like that, and I be like, oh my god. I could have did this shit. But it's cool because I be lazy. I be working too much and my feet be killing me. So anyway, so a little rundown. I'm sure everybody going to have the same rundown for uh for Easter. Um, a little Easter dinner. So sitting here. Got this chicken frying. It's popping. Got the collard greens over there. Got the fish getting ready to line up to be next. Uh... Got some cornbread, and here's the uh, finished chicken. Uh, I only fry much stuff in um, peanut oil. I don't use panko breadcrumbs. I don't like flour. I don't like regular breadcrumbs. You know, to each day on. Everybody likes shit different. Got the cornbread. Uh, it's really not doing no justice. That shit look burnt on this camera, but it really ain't. It's really golden yellow. So anyway, underneath there, there's the um. Here, let me go sit this, sit this uh, stuff right here on top of this pot. So we, yeah, they're the cornbread. That should be like golden. That should be like golden. I'll butter it up as soon as it comes out that oven. Keep it fresh and soft. Underneath here, there's um, and macaroni and cheese. My son is over here, like, trying to gang bust me and then, like, taking food. So, yeah, so, you know, here it go down the breadcrumbs, your little dip joint, you put the food in before you bread it up. And there's the white, just waiting. They should be waiting. They up next. Um, in the oven, we got you. Oh, another joint of macaroni and cheese, because that should be, uh, that should be gone. Sweet potatoes. As soon as everything done, I'll put the marshmallows on them Jones and make them candy hands. But you know you gotta boil your um sweet potatoes and and sugar water. Well, not even sugar water. You keep the juice from the sweet potatoes and you add sugar to it. Yeah, okay, so we got the sweet potatoes, the chicken, collard greens, cornbread. Macaroni and cheese popping. Um, very important. Like, if you knew and you about to fire some chicken, you don't know what the fuck to do. Always use peanut oil. Peanut oil. It'll save you from some burning. So, and always use panko. Panko brand crumbs. Panko. Yeah, he's not. That should be crunchy. Guarantee you. Like you need swift lesson in cooking, you know. Just how yo wait look look you see this this wok here? It got like a little speed dial, you turn it up high, you know, like that. I don't know if y'all can say it, it got darker it? anyways, it plugs up. You don't even it's just sitting on the stove. It's not like heating up by the stove. But this shit's better than uh most pots and deep fires that I've seen, to be honest, which you like to each their own. Insane. You see this rock in the store? Like, it got multiple uses, but just one of those make sure that, uh, get the right one. Good. So, you know, got the chicken pop and about to finish up and do the last little, not a hurry up turn this show before I play myself and burn, burn the last batch. But yeah, so you know, we got Easter popping over here. Keisha you know what the fuck she's doing. She came out of retirement real quick. I ain't bougie with it, but I ain't lacking with it either. I made sure motherfuckers eat good. And we eat right. And we will be full after this meal. And I got a whole pack of chicken. Another pack of chicken to fry. But you know, it is what it is. Alright, everybody have a happy Easter. Just want to, um, share the goods with y'all.
Take care. Bye-bye.